I'm Kiki Palmer, and I'm here to give you some acting nopes, and I'll throw in some yups, too. Early set is an absolute nope. I hate having to come to work early, I really do. If I do have to come early, then I try to bring like a blanket in the car, you know what I mean, on the way so I can try to sleep, or in my trailer, I try to sleep in the makeup chair. I try to sleep until I have to work on set. So yeah, it's an absolute nope. Improvisation without prompting, it's a yup. You know, I mean, I, I definitely prefer to know if somebody wants me to do improv because I actually really respect, you know, obviously a writer's word. So I don't want to add to it if it shouldn't be added to. Uh, but I do love to improv and I can have fun, but I just like to get the signal that it's cool so I don't disrespect the words on the page. Oh, nope, no. You do not disobey what the animal trainer has said. Absolutely not, yeah. When that happened in the movie, I'm like, mm-mm, girl, no. That's why you can't do that. You have to really be, you know, respectful of their job because they know these animals and they know how the animals want to be approached. You cannot disrespect them in, in what they're doing because that's when things go wrong. So yeah, I definitely always take my lead from the animal wranglers and know what I need to do when I don't need to do it. Ignoring continuity is an absolute nope. Okay, I come from the old school where, yes, I let the prop people do their job, I let everybody do their resets, but it's to the point where I will self-reset as well because I really take pride in continuity and things like that. It's one of the first things I learned on set. I did a movie uh, with William H. Macy called The Wool Cap when I was 10 in Montreal. And I remember, you know, I was like, what are you doing? Asking the people that kept bringing everything back. And they said, oh, this is continuity, you know, and they explained to me scripty and all that stuff. And so ever since then, I always took such pride in it, so yeah. You gotta pay attention. Only being sorta of off book is absolute no. Okay, the only thing I'm sorta of on is like the performance that I'm gonna choose. But you've gotta know those lines if you expect to do a performance or have a have a collaboration with the director on what the performance could or couldn't be. You know, you have to know the lines because if you don't know the lines, then how are you gonna play with it? You know, you're gonna be too busy worried about what the lines are, you know? And I don't wanna hold up our whole crew and have everybody there for hours and hours because I didn't study my lines the night before. That's crazy. Making friends with Crafty is absolutely up. Yeah, like why not, you know what I mean? Especially if you guys like end up really getting to know each other and they can give you like some special treats, special little sandwiches, you know? But yeah, it's great. I mean, Crafty is like the unsung hero on every set. Phoning in anything on set is absolute no. You cannot do this. You cannot do this, no, no, no. Because it's like, marking a dance step. If you mark it the whole way, then when it's time to really perform, you're gonna be marking it. So, you know, you can't phone it in. Now, yes, you don't wanna tire yourself out, but you have to be true to it at least a couple of times with your director so you guys can really get into the vibe of it. And then if you need to take a break because you don't wanna overuse your muscle in that moment, that's understandable. But phoning it in totally? No, no, no. I'm Kiki Palmer, and this has been Acting Nopes.